Early morning on Thursday, members of the deceased veteran politician John Sebana Chisto's family, senior police officers and leaders in Kampala converged at Uganda Funeral Services in Bukoto, a Kampala suburb to pick the body of the man who also served as Kampala mayor. The body was then driven to the headquarters of Kampala Capital City Authority at City Hall for a special council sitting to honor his contribution to the development of Kampala. The police band was on hand since this is a state funeral. At the special KCCA council sitting, Deputy Lord Mayor Sala Kanyike Sebagala moved a motion to honor Sebana, who twice served as Kampala mayor between 1999 and 2006. Kanyike's motion was seconded by other councillors. Under this and under this leadership, the council managed to construct the national channel with Jonathan. This channel was constructed from the city centre. But other leaders, you look forward to national. Other he led without the permission. Now Mongo was the slam. It was him who broke the proposal of turning it the way it is. Sebana was recognized for the completion of Ruaga Division offices, securing land for the headquarters of Central Division, construction of Nativo Channel, and roads including Chiwye Salama and Mengo Hill. He was also created with the installation of street lights in Gaba, Kabalagala and Kansanga, as well as securing the passing of a number of ordinances, including that on solid waste management and private schools. Based on this contribution, the council resolved to rename Nachivo Place Road after Sebana Chizito. Christopher Iga, who spoke on behalf of former Kampala mayors, Said Sebana promoted unity and worked well with politicians from other political parties. Today I hear when a party, you lose primarily in a party, you stand as an individual. It's the independence, maturity in the politics that what Sebana has been demonstrating. In a recent interview with NTV, the former Democratic Party president and presidential candidate advised against an attempt to amend the constitution to change the 75-year presidential age limit. DP President Nobat Mau challenged members of parliament to hit to Sebana's council. Sebana Kizito was never a coward. I'm sure even as he lies there, he's telling us no problem can be solved unless it is faced. The late was an ardent supporter of the age limit. NTV engaged some Kampala residents on the KCCA Council's decision to honor Sebana. Whenever we pass around this road and it is named Sebana Chizito, we shall remember him when he is not around. Sebana died on Monday at Nakasaro Hospital after suffering a stroke. A prayer service will be held at his home in Kansanga, Kampala on Thursday evening and another at Namirembe Cathedral on Friday morning. Sevana will be buried on Saturday at his ancestral home in Impande village, Luero district. Habadziwa, NTV.